Hi everyone, good evening. It's me, Wei Tiang here. Today I will share a question which I found to be pretty interesting. It uh, doesn't involve any particular topic, uh, more so it does involve the skills of elimination and deduction. Uh, in a way, it can be put across as a simple heuristics question that involves thinking patterns. So let us get straight into this. I have a four digit number, all my digits are different. My first digit is one sixth of my last, my second is one quarter of my third. What number am I? Well, we gotta start by first looking at this a four digit number. So we have we just have four spaces for that. One, two, three, four. So when we're explaining to our students or our children, we have to tell them that we need to go sequentially. So my first digit is one sixth of my last. In a way, my first digit will be one unit, whereas the sixth digit the last digit will be six units. So we can simply put it down as 1 and 6. Okay. Now, my second digit is 1 quarter of my third. It's the same here. So let's see if I want to draw a model. Second and third. Second is 1 unit. Third is 4 units. Okay. Now, we have to go into the process of elimination here. So let's say if the second digit, second and third, yeah. So if the second digit is 1, the third will be 4. Can this be the case? No, because we already have uh, the first digit being taken up by the digit 1. So this one, we can't have it. Well, if this, the second digit is 2, then the next digit will be 8, because it's 4 times 2, 8. It's possible. We have 2 and 8. We can put 2 and 8 here, and all 4 digits are still the same, all different, because of the first condition. We'll just leave it here first. We want to be very sure. Um, 3, then the next one will be 12. Can we have this? Cannot, because we, it's a single digit and over here we have this 12. So no. So therefore, we can have 1,286. So the number is 1,286. A very simple question that, doesn't, that involves a very simple model drawn. Uh, more importantly, it is actually the cultivation of the thinking habits on how to eliminate other possibilities so that they arrive at the correct answer. So there you have it, how to solve a question. Um, the date for the next model method sharing session is going to be up really soon. And probably by the end of this week we will announce and then we will put up the form for registration. So please do stay, uh, stay in, in touch by subscribing to the channel and uh, stay in touch by looking at the Facebook pages that we always post up on and we will make the announcement for the next model method sharing session really soon. Thank you and have a good evening ahead. Bye-bye.